first glimpse of the gentle giants, and she's live now at the zoo. Lena. John and Mallory, for months and months, excitement has been building, and for the first time today, the public got to come here to this elephant exhibit and see these beautiful animals. I've been waiting for a long time. <laughs> Super excited. On a cold and windy morning, sheer anticipation heated up patrons looking to get the first glimpse of the Henry Dorley Zoo's new elephants. They were so excited this morning. They couldn't wait to get down here. Second happiest day for me lately. The first was when the plane touched down. The second is when Omaha gets to see the elephants. And so it's a goosebump day for me. It's been nearly one month since the six elephants from Swaziland touched down in Omaha. And zoo CEO Dennis Pate says they've adapted quickly to their new indoor environment. The keepers have gotten into a bit of a routine uh, and um, they're just busy out making a living. You know, they're feeding, they're looking for enrichment and treats, uh, they're getting used to the building. When those doors open to the public, hundreds file through, the little ones peering through gates in awe of the gentle giants. It's exciting to see his face when he walked in to see, because he's never seen an elephant up close, so. I don't, it's fun. Even dressed for the big day, Shannon Bruner says she's been tracking their every move. I think it's important that they got out of where they were and that they're somewhere safe. I mean, captivity isn't always the best, but I think they've set up a good habitat for them here. Only the female elephants will be on display for about a month while the male elephant recovers from a swollen ankle he got while in Swaziland. But zoo officials say all of the elephants are very healthy, and as you can see, they're eating well. It's clear the animals every move will be a thrill to patrons here. Shannon says she's already thinking about the next visit. Oh, I'll be back. I think I'll be back on Friday. <laughs> and they're expecting tens of thousands of people to come and visit this exhibit this weekend. And weather permitting, those elephants will be moved outside to their outdoor habitat. Well, Lena, I know a lot of people are wondering when the large outdoor exhibit's going to be complete. Yes, the 3.3 acre grasslands exhibit is expected to open Memorial Day weekend. That's a large exhibit. They'll be uh, with impalas and guinea fowls and zebras in that particular exhibit, but that won't be open until Memorial Day weekend. Yeah, three acres. That is huge. Zoo staff also says if the weather doesn't allow